Okay, welcome to Palazzo Safari. This is uh, Lynn and Spartaco, our designer. second floor. kitchen but this will be the new front door into the salon okay so this is the salon under construction obviously okay and then Spartaco where are we going next the kitchen so now we're going to visit the kitchen if you come you can follow me please These are the electrical and plumbing pipes on the floor. So here a, um, is a kitchen. This is the original fireplace, which uh, we wanna use also. And here basically is uh, where the, uh, the cooking area is gonna be. Here we have uh, this uh, beautiful marble uh, sink uh, deep. I mean, we want to have this uh, block of marble dig inside, and it's going to be like uh, an original marble um, sink um, house. Lead. So basically, a, a farm sink a farm made sink. out of marble, Ma dug out of the same uh, stone block. That's it. Well, okay. So now, um, going to the next room. Uh, um, this right here, by the way, will be uh, the wall for the oven, microwave, ice maker, and refrigerator. Um, then, um, ah, something very important I forgot. Here is gonna be like uh, the like uh, is gonna, like a butcher table with a very thick uh, wooden top. And the idea is to have this concept of a butcher kind of shop. And with the wheels, so in this way, guests they they guess they can move around the table if they need to with the chairs and being around, or maybe having something quick to eat here instead of using the living room. Then uh, moving to the next room, um, this is a kind of. Uh, well, so how about this room right here, straight ahead? Oh, here. Sorry, this is uh, is uh, is going to be one of the bathroom. Uh, one of the bathrooms, which the look of this bathroom is um, pretty much uh, back to the kind of look, 30, 30 the look of bathroom with uh, gonna be white towels. And then obviously uh, we decide for the floor that our princess here, Lynn, she was the one that actually uh, choose the, the floor, which is gonna be black and white uh, kind of uh, decoration, white tiles. And then coming out from the bathroom here um, is gonna be our let's put it way like a wine concept uh, um, furniture because also I'm sure that all of you know that uh, Taylor and here they actually that are into the wine business so on. So my idea was to incorporate into this apartment, the concept of wine, because also wine is a part of the Italian culture. So we try to to, the, the, to keep it this way. Then going to the next room. Well, what do we have here? Ah, sorry. This we're gonna have a kitchen pan pantry. 
this is gonna be the kitchen pantry so where all the food will be stored and uh, uh, food and drinks also will be stored here and uh, going to the next room we turn Go ahead, into like uh, what I was saying like uh, the highlights of the whole apartment basically we are now standing in this uh, uh, beautiful living room uh, decorated with the fresco uh, all those fresco are dated back to the end of 1800 beginning of 900 and um, uh, and this apartment was uh, below a very important family here in Soriano called the Caliento and Sapori family um, what we do now here, obviously we have the artist that uh, he can and starting to decorate in the whole fresco, obviously. And, um, and there are a few ideas that uh, we will have to, um, um, in, in, uh, in, as a new design where we're going to incorporate in these, on those walls. Then from here we're going to the next room here. Um, which uh, in this room ah, we have uh, here is going to be the laundry the laundry is going to be the dishwasher and the dryer uh, clothes washer ah sorry washing machine dryer and uh, all the uh, the boiler um, and the sink uh, so and this uh, this room basically is uh, the specular uh, is a specular uh, uh, section as it was on the other side. Basically, this wall is gonna be uh, like um, as a wine the wine concept wall with a different uh, obviously wine display on the on the shelves. Then going to uh, next room, we have. Uh, we come into uh, the master bedroom of, uh, the, um, of the apartment. Um, so, uh, as you can tell, it's a quite big size uh, room. We have a decorating ceiling, and then also here, we're gonna, the, the, the design of this is gonna be a lambre on the bottom here, then a fascia all around, decorating fascia all around the ceiling. We have the bedroom is going to be on this side, and then um, going this way from the master bedroom, you can access to the bathroom. So now the bathroom here. Um, here, what we have, we have a is a master bathroom here. Uh, the main kind of uh, attraction of the master bathroom, we're going to put. Uh, decorated and make the shower uh, box of, of the bathroom with the onyx. We're gonna cover up with the onyx stone. Then it's gonna be um, waste coating this area. And that area is where the sink is gonna be. Um, and then what we're gonna, uh, and then come, coming into the, uh, the, the master bedroom. Here uh, they, we have like a small fireplace where um, the fireplace, this is gonna be like the corner like with a few uh, standing lamp and two chairs and there is uh, it's gonna be the bedroom it's gonna be the bed so then moving back to the living room And the way we uh, come out with the light up to the living room, our idea, I mean, that's our idea is gonna be the dining table here, uh, sofa and chairs and standing lamps, and, and or we're going also to uh, replace the fireplace. We're gonna put the original stone of the fireplace. And then from the living area, we enter what we call the guest room. So the guest room, um, here, um, we, the way we're going to decorate this room, 
uh, is gonna be our lambre here, uh, um, and then a fascia, the decorating fascia that goes all the way around, um, decorating ceiling, and the bedroom, the bed is gonna be that side, and then uh, from this side, we enter the, the guest room bathroom. And, and then here, what uh, we decide for this uh, bathroom, we're gonna have the, the shower uh, box of this bathroom. It's gonna you know, finish with these uh, vintage tiles, uh, vintage tile on the wall here. Then uh, we're gonna have a walk-in shower, just with a glass here. Here, uh, we're gonna have the sink, and uh, the toilet on the other side. And here, the way we're gonna finish the wall, we're gonna use the resin. So the concept is to give a, you know, um, concept of modern, a mixture of modern design with a um, antique uh, kind of uh, look of the, the apartment. So that's kind of combination that, that we are thinking of doing. So now from here, we're going back again to the living room and we now we enter the last room of the apartment that we call the studio which uh, because we call the studio because originally this space was uh, dedicated for the studio for the Scaliento and Sapori family, but we convert this uh, studio into another room. And again, the way we decorate, we're thinking of decorating this uh, room, again, we have a lambri um, and the fascia, decorating fascia on top, um, plain wall uh, painting, and, but, but there is something that you should know that uh, this is an idea of uh, Leon and Taylor, the decoration that we're gonna make in this room and the master bedroom, as well as the guest room. In each room, there will be something that will uh, uh, basically uh, remind of, uh, you know, the, the new owner of uh, the um, Sapore Caliento, um, uh, Sapori uh, the apartment. So basically, here is gonna be what we say the princess room of Lyon. So and the decoration will be there will be something we, we, which right now is a secret, but later on you will find out. But it's gonna be something a decoration which recall of the culture of um, the region of uh, Lyon. And then on the master bedroom, there is uh, something, a decoration which we remind of uh, something which we remind the Taylor's family and um, where it basically the origin of Taylor, where it comes from. And because obviously, you know, Taylor and Leon, they are into the wine business. And so in the guest room, the decoration the, of the guest room, there will be something which will, will remind people about why. So as I said, the details of this we don't release right now. It's something that to find out you have to come here, visit us, and then you will discover into it the uh, And then basically that's it. Ciao. 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 <laughs> well let me finish with a view out of the windows. Lynn, can you open those windows? So the apartment itself is on the main square in Soriano. And from the studio room, you can actually see the 11th century castle and the Duomo.